Hello, my name is Roderick Curry, and for Black History Month, I would like to present to you all a piece on African-American film director Oscar Micheaux. Oscar Micheaux was born on January 2nd, 1884, near Metropolis, Illinois, and was one of 13 children of former slaves. As a youth, he formed his publishing company and used the motion picture industry as a vehicle to tell stories. In 1919, he became the first African-American to make a film, which was the silent film The Homesteader, starring Evelyn Prayer. His first talking film was 1931's The Exile. He was able to make himself the first black film auteur without the slightest help from film industries and against race and class prejudice, along with the lack of higher education. In his 1924 film, Body and Soul, he introduced the world to Paul Robeson. During his career, he produced and directed 44 feature-length films and wrote, published, and distributed seven novels. His overachieving goal was to attain and maintain a middle-class status through social uplift. Mr. Michaud produced cinema that is distinguished by a unique combination of authorial and discursive qualities. Through his work, he demonstrated that middle-class cinema can succeed in the right hands and resist racism and sexism. The Producers Guild of America called him the most prolific black, if not most prolific independent filmmaker in America cinema. Oscar Michaud passed away on March 25, 1951 at the age of 67. This is Ryder Curry reporting for Xavier News on the Muscle.